What up, y'all? Conscious one, come back at you. Look who we got here. Like Rakim, it's been a long time. Borax. Got some boron. Especially since we about to really start hitting the gym. You know, it's getting warm. You know, I got to be looking good when it's warm, you know. But yeah, got the borax back. No need to go into why I got that. I always use baking soda. That's what's in this bag right there. I've been brushing my teeth with baking soda. And I do use I do use bottled water to brush my teeth. I've been doing that for about 10, 13 years. So between between not putting fluoride in my mouth and not watching television, I've never owned HD TV. I think to myself, I say, man, you don't know what a consciousness of these people is. They could be straight up zombified or body snatched. You know, again, not not having watched HD TV. I never owned HD TV. Not having floor out of my mouth for the past 13 years. Spirit tell me, you just don't know how much far these people go on with their consciousness, man. You don't. You just don't know how calcified they is. Recently, y'all, I had a parasitic infection with, with the thread worms. First time that happened in my life. I passed about 200 worms coming out of my body. It's disgusting. You think I'm only, well, at that time I was 175. I'm back down to 165 right now. But if you think of somebody like myself with a small frame that eats once a day can pass out 200 worms. Imagine with somebody that's, you know, overweight, obese, how many worms they got in them. Because see, the thing is, I was able to catch it because I'm constantly eliminating. You know what I'm saying? I'm constantly eliminating detoxing, so I caught them in a stool. But when somebody is like obese, it don't come out in their stool because they so backed up. It'll probably be years before they even see one worm. So, you know, it's all messing up their liver. It's, it's getting into their brain. And God forbid, they're probably dropping these parasites on us, y'all. And this, was, this is what the medical industry don't tell you. They don't tell you that you have to do a parasite cleanse every few months, just like you with your dog, a dog dewormer. You have to deworm yourself, guys. Even if you don't suspect you have worms, you still got to do it every every four to six months. Now, I can go over a lot of things that I was taking to get rid of them worms, but no no sense. I, I'm going to get straight to the point where I really got rid of them. And I was this diatomaceous herb. I recently saw a guy, he know who he is. I paid $10 for this four-pound bag probably last two years. This guy, <laughs> he was selling it for like one ounce of this powder and i think he was selling that shit for like 20 bucks that dude trying to get it that dude trying to uh he trying to become a millionaire off of off of a ten dollar four pound bag of diatomaceous earth funny though when i bought this for ten dollars for four pounds i checked a few days later it was twenty dollars for this bag i said look now nah, look at these mother look what they doing but this is the best way to detox from worms guys it, it, what it does it dries them out and, and gets rid of them eggs. So no need to go into more on that, but it's very important you do a parasite cleanse. That's what the medical industry, they don't tell you that parasites cause a lot of diseases and it also is responsible for spreading the cancer throughout the body. So you wanna be taking this, I believe it's like a 10 day cycle. You go on and off. You know, you take like a teaspoon or two teaspoons in the morning on empty stomach, glass of water, do that for 10 days, and then you cycle off 10 days and cycle back on. That's how you deal with this. And like I said, they might be dropping parasites on us. I wouldn't be surprised because I'm wondering how I get them threat worms in me like that, you know? But if you eat meat, though, you got some worms. Oh, you gonna, or you're going to get some worms sooner or later. That's why I'm glad I'm not eating meat. You know what I'm saying? So this easy does it, guys. But I can't wait. I'm glad I got this borax. And I'll holler at y'all later. Peace.